a festive moment for Nissan and the Zee Bruchport because the first Nissan car carriers just have docked. From now on, all Nissan cars produced in England for the North and French and the Benelux market will be unloaded at this terminal. For the port, this is economically very important. It is in elk geval belangrijk voor de verdere verconcentratie. Eigenlijk als auto hub staan we op kaart en dat kan alleen maar verder op kaart staan als die cluster, die diepsi en shortsi netwerk verder groeit. En dus zo'n volume bij van 100.000 wagens is natuurlijk een voeding voor die cluster samen met die uh, verbinding die we daarbij hebben. En het is ook zeer belangrijk voor onze Japanse cluster, die eigenlijk 40% van de auto's in Zeebrugge zijn Japans. En dat versterkt nog eens uh, die Japanse aanwezigheid, wat ook goed is voor de anderen uh, die hebben dan vertrouwen in die haven. This and also is very delighted to expand its activities in the Zeebrugge-Port. Transportation time now is reduced substantially. The car dealers and hence the customers will have their new Nissan cars faster than ever available. Twice a week car carriers will dock and about 1,000 cars will each time roll off. On a yearly base, Zeebrugge is to expect about 95,000 new Nissan cars. Most of the vehicles are coming from uh, the Nissan Sunderland plants, so we have in Juke. New Qashqai, Node and Leaf. By choosing this port and terminal, Nissan quintuples the number of cars delivered in Zeebrugge. Thanks to these increasing activities, ICO, International Car Operators, which is responsible for unloading, has hired about 50 new employees. With the quality we have from staff, with the, quality, the engagement we have from staff and management and the close cooperation we have with the, with the port authorities, I am absolutely sure that we will grow even further. Partly depends on the economy, of course, in Europe, but in principle there should be no reason with the engagement which is here amongst people that we should not be able to grow in the, in the years to come.